Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am so glad that you guys came over today to see another brand new video. So today me and my mom went to Costco. It was so much fun and we just kind of looked around. We like legit weren't going there for anything. She had like a couple things she needed but honestly I just wanted to look around. And we took our time, we looked at all the things and we had a lot of fun. So I will show you what I got. I didn't get a ton of food stuff but I feel like I kind of splurged and got some things for myself. Don't forget to subscribe and let's get to the haul. All right, so $250 from Costco looks like this. Yeah, it's not very much, but I bought kind of a lot of clothing and that can add up super quick. So I'll show you guys. I wanted to read this book. I've gone to Target twice looking for it. Yeah cannot I don't know what the deal is but it, they say it's in stock and then I go there and it's not so it's happened to me twice I saw it there I don't even know if that's a really good price compared to Target but I was just tired of going to Target for it so I got it there uh, went ahead and got some grapes these were on sale for about $7.99 this is a huge thing though it's four pounds and they are so big look at these grapes y'all so big I got two things of salad. I'm not doing a bunch of cooking because my husband's out of town right now. So when he's out of town, I kind of go light or kind of easy. More, I guess you could say more on the cooking. So I got some salad stuff. This one we love. The Caesar salad. Oh my gosh. Love it. So worth it. And this will probably at least last us two meals. Um, if my husband's not here. But you never know we might just eat the whole thing it's really good and then this one is the almond the cherry almond blue and I wasn't sure that I would like this dressing but I did like that the salad had a lot of kale and um, dried cherries and I was like you know what let me just try this salad and see how I like it I needed some oranges so we just got some cuties while we were there these are for my husband and since he's out of town perfect I can actually get a present right so this will be probably one of his Christmas presents that hopefully I can hide from him I feel like roast is the best at Costco though like that's a really good deal at Costco this is actually round roast and not chuck roast but I had a couple of meals that I thought would be better with round roast and one of them was actually the beef tips that I made in my last crock pot meal I thought maybe cutting these up and having less fat would be better on that so I'm gonna try that but as you can see this was um, for two of the roasts and it's almost five pounds of meat $22.95 we have not bought these in a hot minute but me and my son both love these they're the, just the chewy granola bars. I want to say they're like $7.99, um, but we love them. So what we really went to Costco for was candy, actually, y'all. Um, we get tons of trick-or-treaters, and um, she was like, I bet you the cheapest place to get candy is Costco. So we went and got candy there, and I want to say these were... Um, one was like $14.99 and one was $13.99. I want to say they're around 150 pieces each. Big old huge bags. This is like a chocolate one, so it has all the things. And this is like a gummy one, and it, you can see it has all the things. So I'm hoping that that will be good. And I'll probably get like, I don't know, some pretzels and stuff too, just in case. Because people will tell me that my neighborhood's crazy for Halloween, so we'll see. Um, and I did get from Costco if you guys aren't doing it we registered for the teal pumpkin map and I got little um, Play-dohs there's like 50 of them for ten dollars and so they're basically for People with like food allergies and things like that so they can still trick-or-treat and have fun And it's a called a teal pumpkin campaign. Have you guys heard of this? I hadn't heard about it till a couple years ago, and I really wanted to be able to participate so that's what we're doing for Halloween. I got this guy. OMG. Okay. This is the softest blanket. And I saw it. We were just down the aisle and I saw it. And I was like, oh my gosh, this looks amazing. And even on the inside, as you can see, like the inside's fuzzy. And it's a 60 by 20, or wait, 
it's a 60 by 70 I want to say and so it has this cool little leather thing to hold it um, that I'll probably never use again because you know how that goes but maybe and but this was the tag this was probably one of the more expensive things I bought probably the the most expensive thing I bought but it was like forty dollars it was thirty nine ninety nine and I am just a sucker for blankets and it was so soft I can't even tell you how soft it is guys so it was just something I wanted for winter out here in my living room instead of like this throw so on to some clothes for me so I find it I find it easier to show you guys the tags versus the whole piece of clothing, but I got this Fila sweater. It was like a pullover hoodie type of thing. Well, it doesn't have a hood, but like a pullover sweater. This was on sale for $4.97, so I couldn't even pass that up for $4.97, and we recently got like a projector, and I've been watching movies outside, and um, like on our garage, and I thought, you know what, even for like that, $4.97 is perfect. So I sized up and got it just just cuz um, This shirt was actually $4.97 as well. It's a Jessica Simpson and I don't know it just it, I really liked this green color It really looked cute and I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna go for it for $4.97 And so most of the time I get good deals on the $4.97 stuff in Costco. Let me tell you Okay, so these I have no idea if I'm gonna love or hate I don't know um, I got a black and a white they each come with two long sleeve shirts but I thought just for like at night when I'm you know editing and I just get cold so easily that I thought these would be good and it's just a staple under anything and the one there was one that was open and so I actually sized up because the one that was open it just seemed like it wasn't very stretchy so I don't know how that's gonna work but they were only ten dollars a piece so really that makes it like five dollars a shirt if they're good if not you guys know Costco has an amazing return policy so I just went ahead and and got them because I knew if I went back they wouldn't be there these are some like athletic kind of pants like workout pants I've been going to yoga and um, bar trying to go like five days out of the seven out of the week and sometimes I'm really good at it, sometimes I'm not. And yeah, so I only had one pair. Could you imagine? One pair. So I'd been washing them like crazy and I was like, I need to get another pair. The thing I do like is I like that it has this side thing that I can like tuck my phone in because I feel like I have to carry my yoga mat in even to do bar. And cause it's like a yoga studio that does like cardio bar. And I really like having this little pocket on the side. It's very convenient. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna go for that. I wanna say these were 15. And I got another pair of these leggings. I actually bought these a couple weeks ago. I wanna say they're the same. And I really, really liked them. Wore them um, when we were traveling in DC a couple weeks ago. Really liked them, so comfy. And I wasn't sure because they didn't have this a really thick waist up here but they were perfect so I just decided to get another pair and they were about 15 as well so you can see totals add up fast man this was my find of the day I was so proud of this okay these were on sale for $5.99 for the three pairs now if y'all are a homeschool mom or just a mom you know that like the scissors just go missing all the time so for really nice scissors, big scissors, $5.99, that's like $2 a pair. I was like, yes, please. No, I did not even hesitate. I just threw them in my cart. So apparently, I was in like a cold, sweatery mood <laughs> today, but um, this is another sweater that I got, and this one was $10. It is, um, it actually is a hoodie, so it does have a hood, as you can tell right there, and it's so soft, and the thing I liked about it was that this furry, like the actual fur, is on the inside too. So sometimes, like, when you buy this Sherpa, I know you guys feel me, like, the inside isn't very soft, and the outside feels amazing, and then the inside's like, eh but this one the inside was super soft too and it was the same material so I was like okay let's try it out for ten dollars can't go wrong all right I know this looks like a lot of wine but I swear it's all not for me <laughs> um the this wine is for 
um, I have this thing in my neighborhood called the wine fairy and basically it's like where you put a little care package together you leave it on somebody's doorstep and you dust them so um, I got dusted a couple weeks ago and then I did two more and I dusted two more people and I was like you know what I really want to dust some more people and I just think it's a nice thing and I was like well what do they have at Costco let's see and lots of people liked um, the white kind of wines so I just grabbed these are like Pinot Grigios I have no idea but I feel like people aren't picky too much about wine and hey I think it will be good these are Moscatos I haven't decided if I'm gonna dust these um, but look at these bottles isn't it so pretty like I just thought the bottle was pretty too but these um, were a little bit more. I got these in case I have some girlfriends over since my husband's out of town. I thought maybe I would have my girlfriends over and drink some wine. So I grabbed some of these while I was at the store just to have on hand. And then if it doesn't end up happening, I'll just put a little care package together and go dust somebody. So maybe I'll take you guys along if I dust somebody. All right, guys. So that was all I got today at Costco. But if you want to see more of my Costco hauls, I will leave them up here on the screen for you. Um, I have a whole playlist of Costco hauls and all the things that I usually get that I like. And I really like stocking up at Costco for a variety of different things but this was just a fun Costco trip so what did you think do you usually buy a lot of clothes at Costco because I have really good luck with clothes at Costco but um, what do you guys buy like what's your staple items because I would love to go and buy your staple items and try them out as well so let me know and maybe I'll do that video coming up next don't forget to hit that like button and that subscribe button and I will see y'all in another brand new video